It's not quite the latest addition to the Final Fantasy canon, but Stranger of Paradise is almost here, so is it worth getting excited about? I'm AJ, this is 128KB, and make sure you hit that subscribe button for more gaming news and PS5 previews. Okay, so I'll admit it, this is kind of a weird one. Stranger of Paradise Final Fantasy Origin is an action role-playing game being developed by Ninja Theory. You may have seen the bizarre E3 trailer where the word chaos is uttered nearly 90 times in the span of a three minute video. This, along with the game's questionable quality, at least as far as the appearance goes, has led to the game becoming something of a meme. Hopefully, it can reverse the memory and gain a reputation for being a competent action game in its full release, coming this March. If you're a fan of action games, Final Fantasy, or even chaos memes, here are some things that you should know about Stranger of Paradise Final Fantasy Origin. Stranger of Paradise has you playing as Jack Garland, a warrior from another world who has been sucked into a dark fantasy version of the original Final Fantasy game. Along with your fellow warriors Ash and Jed, you will satisfy Jack's insatiable hunger for destroying chaos, there it is again, in this game. Chaos is a reference to the demon who served as the final boss in the original Final Fantasy. To get to chaos, you'll have to traverse locations from the first Final Fantasy game recreated in full 3D with high quality graphics. You'll also fight the series' many signature monsters, though they are designed differently, being a new interpretation of the series. This new interpretation concept is the very core of Stranger of Paradise, as what at first looked like a straight up retelling of the first game has been revealed by the developers to not actually be part of the canon, but instead be a story of how things could have possibly happened. As an advantage of being a unique story rather than a remake of sorts, Stranger of Paradise features intense real-time combat rather than turn-based action. You can equip two out of the total 27 jobs available in the game which determine your fighting style and abilities in encounters and eliminate enemies with both physical and magical attacks. The jobs you select will also determine which of the eight weapon types you are able to use in combat. With weapons like the Great Sword being used by the Swordsman, and warrior jobs and maces being used by the mage and black mage jobs, for example. The real-time combat in Stranger of Paradise is the most violent combat in any Final Fantasy game so far, with Jack becoming covered in blood as he slices and dices the creatures he faces, whittling down their health and their break gorge until he can use a very cool looking finisher move. These finisher animations have Jack punching and slamming the enemy around and turning them into red crystals which explode and refill a portion of your magic gauge. This break from Final Fantasy's typical combat might be Stranger of Paradise's most intriguing aspect. So if you can get past the memes and the bizarreness of the footage that has been shown of Strange of Paradise, there is what appears to be a very cool looking action game hidden underneath. I hope that the final product is something that resonates with people and becomes successful because all gamers win when developers take chances on strange ideas and execute them competently. Yeah.